Hi. Uh, so I just had another uh, deliverance session yesterday. And uh, it went really well. Basically, um, I, I went through the uh, Bob Larson um, curse-breaking book. And uh, I repeated a ton of renunciations to curses that were, uh, a lot of them were on me. And as I did so, basically I was uncontrollably like coughing because basically stuff was like jumping, you know, coming up my throat and out. And that causes like a physical, uh, response of like letting it out kind of. And, uh, yeah, a lot of stuff came out of me a ton. And, uh, yeah, so that's a big chunk of spiritual freedom that I now have. So that's really good. Um, so, yes, the Bob Larson, uh, book is the, uh, it's, uh, it's not just any book written, it was, uh, uh, the Holy Spirit, um, was basically telling Bob Larson, the author, uh, what to have in the book, so that's why I'm guessing it's written the way it is, but yeah, it, uh, helped me out, broke a ton of curses and stuff, bloodline stuff, and, uh, and that's good, you know, because you have to basically, uh, find out about deliverance and then you have to go ahead and do it, you know, and then you can be spiritually free. It's basically, uh, but yeah, make make the effort to actually uh, contact the deliverance minister from the Isaiah Saldivar map. Okay. Uh, it's free. And, uh... Oh, yeah. And, uh, also, while I was doing it, um, basically, uh, demons sometimes mess up with electronics like one time when i joined a uh a uh, video call for fellowship with some group of brothers in christ this group i was uh joining basically uh a demon turned my like router off and then i had to go turn it back on and like my router never goes out for like like a year or two at a time and it just went out that exact time like five minutes into the call. So that's, you know, that's a demon who did that. And then also while I was on the deliverance call, um, it wasn't this one. It was like the time before, uh, basically, uh, the screen was glitching pink and it was doubling, uh, the deliverance minister I was talking to on the screen. Um, and it was like glitching pink and then, uh, and that was a demon. That's not just random, uh, technical interference. That's a demon interfering with it because they're fully aware of somebody's doing deliverance on a Zoom call. So then the deliverance minister would literally bind it and, you know, tell it to knock it off and bind it in, uh, Jesus name. I forget exactly what they said. And then it would stop and then it would start up maybe like 15 minutes later. Uh, once we literally were like saying something really hard hitting and like breaking a really good curse, it would literally start up like, like on point of timing of when it wanted to do that. And then, uh, the deliverance minister would bind it and stop it. And then the interference would go away. And it was like a pink, it was turning the screen like, a. A pink see-through-ish so I'm seeing everything's in pinkish 
and then uh, it was doubled, and then it was glitchy too, it was glitching, uh, so yeah, it was kind of freaky too, but in a way, it was almost uh, kind of uh, exciting that I'm doing something so important spiritually that demons are trying to attack, except, uh, you know, that's why it's such a good thing to go through, you know? So, yeah, uh, I really recommend that, uh, everyone, uh, go through with it if you were on the, uh, fence, let's say. Yeah. So, yeah, um, I think that's all that happened, uh, at one point, um, at one point, uh, the minister, uh, put Jezebel, um, under, uh, under an attack to hurt the demon Jezebel, and then I uncontrollably, I, like, coughed in a, uh, in, like, a, uh, kind of, like, a, a beat way, like, a cough if someone, like, somehow, like, I guess, hit you at the same time. Like, it was a cough out, not just, like, a cough to clear your throat. Um, so, yeah. Uh, that's some manifesting right there. So, all right. Um, that's some of the details that I can remember off the top of my head. And uh, if anything else uh, comes up in further sessions, I'll make sure to... Uh, tell about it and yeah so that's it